Welcome back guys, hope you guys had a good weekend. Today we're gonna work on the shovel. First on the list is to fix the broken exhaust mount for the front pipe. Then we're gonna flare out the rear like the front. Let's get to it. All right, next we're gonna be working on the rear. Gonna turn it out using this piece right here. All right, got the ring on. All right, got the pipes done. Next, we're gonna work on the headlight wiring. So for the headlight wire, I'm gonna add a connector. That way in the future, if I need to remove the headlight, I can just unplug it instead of removing the wire from the ignition switch. This is the connector that I'm using. I bought it on Amazon. This one is a two wires connector. For this job, I'm only gonna use one wire since the ground is already grounded through the headlight. And also I bought these cloth wire to run from the headlight to the connector so it looks uh, more old school.
All right, all done. All right, the next mod will change the look of the bike completely. A couple days ago, the homie Joshua hit me up and asked if I wanted to buy the gas tank that he won from a raffle. He said he's been thinking a lot lately and he wasn't sure when he would get a Harley to run that tank and he'd rather see it on my bike than collecting dust at home. So yeah, I'm the new owner of this badass tank. It was painted by the talented Jeremiah. This is my first custom painted tank. My bike is officially a one of one now. But yeah, let's take a moment to appreciate this tank. It's so beautiful. But yeah, I was hoping it would be a simple swap over, but life doesn't work that way. My old tank is from TC Bros and this tank is from Lowbrow Customs. The Lowbrow tank is a bit shorter, so I gotta drill and tap a new rear mount. So I bought these uh, drill and tap combo. One eternity later. All right, just finished with the uh, tank swap. Gonna take it outside and start it. 